Hey guys. Okay. So this is the closet clean out sale. Um, and, um, and it's going to be kind of like a choppy video. The last part is clothing. I'm, I'm frustrated because I took, I spent like an hour taking pictures of accessories so that I could just like pop, 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 you know, and like, it's easy to screenshot. And, um, and I took the pictures wrong or I don't know how to put them into the movie. I don't know. And I don't have time to figure it out. So, um, after I'm done filming this little intro, I'm going to do a quick showing you guys the accessories, um, which are all, which are all $5. Um, and, um, it is a first come first serve situation. So when you love something, screenshot it and then email it to info at redbirdvintagebox.com with your PayPal address and your shipping address. Even if we've shipped to you before or like you're a subscriber and you're like, she has my information, go ahead and just put it all in the email so that um, it's, sh it's just easier. It just makes things go a lot faster. Um, and um, you know, you can send multiple emails because you might see like two accessories that you want and you know, a clothing item later. I think this is going to be, it, it was 40 minutes and now I know it's gonna be longer because I'm filming the accessories and this thing. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you have any questions, I will be around the computer for um, probably until about 8.30 or nine o'clock um, Sunday evening, because I think this is being posted at seven o'clock on Sunday. And, um, and yeah, so I hope that you guys find something. Um, there are accessories like, um, I think it was like five scarves for five dollars and then two beaded necklaces for five dollars and like two pairs of earrings for five dollars and those are all randomly selected by me and those are those are going to be limited like if for some reason I'm getting too many people wanting that I'll have to stop because it's really just um um like the update on the new on the new workspace like you can see I'm trying to not fold boxes because it's so much easier to move the boxes um, on my ring is showing that the electricians are back at the other house, which they're not done yet. And that's a whole thing. Okay. So I just cut out a whole bunch of stuff because I went on a, on a rant about the house, but I will definitely be chatting about it in the June 1st request video. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to show you accessories. Um, these are all, they're older, like not like, like they're older stock. Um, and, um, some of them are modern, and I'm gonna try to do it as quickly as possible. And so if you're not wanting accessories, then just, you know, scroll forward until you start seeing me doing the clothing. And um, and yeah, again, first come, first serve, info at redbirdvintagebox.com. Um, I will be responding to emails and sending invoices um, tonight, Sunday evening, and also tomorrow morning, Monday. And, um, and then all of these items will be shipped out on probably Tuesday. Um, some might go out on Monday if like you pay right away and it's easy for me to pack up, but I have um, some of the boxes that I have to get out on Monday and um, that has to, they paid before you guys. <laughs> so, so it's probably gonna be Tuesday when these ship out. Okay, so let's get started on the accessories. Okay, so part of the reason that I did not want to show accessories this way, also these are all $5, but you do still have the $10 shipping charge like if you're not buying anything else it's just a flat ten dollar shipping um so anyways so one of the reasons i didn't want to show this is because you know i had the photos set to be like you know um two seconds each and this is obviously going to be more than two seconds each and also i haven't had a manicure in forever so also it's just confusing Ugh. i mean again hopefully I was going to say, hopefully I can get a social media person soon, but this isn't really social media. This is just a sale video, but the pictures are way better. I might just end up posting the pictures too on the Facebook subscriber group and um, so that the girls can kind of see things. So this is a modern, but I don't know where it's from, but it's got the moon and everything and everybody likes those. I don't think it's the locket. I can't get it open. Ugh, my nails look terrible. It's embarrassing. I don't know what to say. I'm working on the house. It's busy. Hoping I can keep this under five minutes. We'll see. We'll see if I can. So, um, you know, this is modern too. You can kind of see that. I really 
don't love this way. That's fun. Oh, but yeah, I'm hoping to move out some stuff. This is really pretty. It is missing a stone and it is modern. And the stone you can see is missing right there. But it's really, really pretty. This is missing a couple stones as well. It is a locket. It's really pretty, but it is somewhat damaged. A little cloisonne bead. Oh my gosh, my ring notifications keep going off. I, I, I've been putting off the painter slash patcher who's doing like the drywall patching forever. And it's not even that I've been putting him off. The um the electric company's like, oh yeah, we're, um you know, we're coming out tomorrow. We're doing the initial inspection. And then you just need to patch everything up for us to continue on. And I'm like, cool. So I schedule everything. And then nobody calls me to tell me. Oh, sorry. So that's, that's what that looks like. Um, nobody calls to tell me that no, actually the inspector did not come out um, and he's coming out tomorrow. So I only found that out. This is, these are two necklaces for $5. And there will be a, um, a quick little video that, you know, says two necklaces for $5. And you'll see a couple of the beaded necklaces. We just have a lot of beaded. That includes pearl beaded necklaces. Um, some will be double strand, some won't. So, um, and then some obviously are, are single for $5. This one is long. I mean, I hope this isn't giving you guys a headache. This one is a little bit heavier. It is still plastic beads. You know, I'm really bad at telling my materials. Um, A little collar necklace. What was I saying? I don't even remember. But anyways, oh yeah, so the patcher is is coming out today because he was going to come and just do some sanding um, before he started. And he is a doll. And I'm I'm a little nervous because I honestly, I, I he, he had good reviews through Facebook. But then when I met him, he just was like the most polite. Um, I think he's like, a, I think he's young 20s, guys. I, it's very possible that he's not even, um, it's possible that he's like 18. I don't know why this looks like there's white crud. Like in person, I mean, you can't, I can't see anything, but it's just like a little clutch. And I think it's just the, the lighting of it is um, making it look like that. It's cute. A little satin little velvet um this is like a little makeup case anyways he um he had good reviews but as and so I booked him because he just was amazing with communication and so polite and so sweet and then after I booked him um so these are clip back earrings I kind of deep dived more into just his background and while he definitely looks like he has the experience um he and his brother like just started this company during the pandemic. I'm not sure how much work they've actually gotten, but um I'm just going to I'm just going to trust him because I chose the electric company literally based on their amazing hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of reviews and them saying that they could get it done in 10 days and that's turned into just a nightmare. Oh, and th that was a, a brooch. Um Roach. And so again, these are all five dollars, and um, you know, there might be like a tiny bit of wear on them, but they're not like a damaged item. Um, and if you oh, this is a set. Um, if you want to look on the website at the add-on items, you can do that too if you are not a subscriber and still use the free shipping code if you're purchasing something from here and um and then your add-on items would just ship with with this order 
I don't like that. This is really heavy and really pretty, but um, I'm assuming it's modern. It's like glass that has that modern, modern clasp. Um, that one, this one could use a cleaning, but the beads are, are gorgeous. I don't, I don't think it's, I don't think it's milk glass, but it, it definitely has that feel. These are plastic, it's super cute. That is, I don't know if you can see that it's like a sheen. Necklace. One of these necklaces. Seven minutes and 30 seconds. So accessories are probably gonna be about 10 minutes. So this is gonna be almost an hour video, I think. Okay. So five randomly selected scarves for $5. Um, you don't get to choose. It's just there are a ton of scarves that have not found homes and I'd like to get through them. So five scarves for $5. It is still the $10 shipping if you don't order anything else, but five scarves, $5. Two randomly selected beaded necklaces for $5 and it's, you have got them kind of, they're like everywhere. I don't want to show you over there because I'm packing and it's disgusting. <laughs> I mean, this looks pretty bad too, but, um, but do it'll be beaded necklaces. So, you know, anything with, with the beads Two randomly selected for $5, two randomly selected pairs of clip back earrings for $5. And it will just be, you know, random. There's some screw backs too. You could say that you want screw backs, but there's more clips, a lot of clips. Two pair, $5, randomly selected by me. So I have this huge tub of earrings. It's pretty much almost all clip on. And then there is jewelry down here. Um, some is damaged, like this one's like missing, like a stone right there, you can see. Um, there's there's so much of it that it was just kind of, cause I was going through everything. So when I was going through everything, if something was damaged or had like, like a loose um, string or some dead stones, um, I threw it in here to do like a lot later, like a, like a lot on eBay, but um, we can do like a, like a small flat rate box filled with stuff for like $20 and a medium flat rate box for like $40, but it's literally just me gonna be like picking stuff out and putting it in there. That's, it's all sorts of, it's all sorts of stuff. Mostly good, but also mostly like there's gonna be a flaw. Okay, so this is the clothing portion. Like my hair is staticky. I should probably get urban. It'll be fine. Okay, so clothing we've got um we've got 10, 25, 50, and a hundred dollar item. So we're gonna go ahead and start with the ten dollar items. This little dress does have spotting, it's got a bust of 32 and it is pretty much 40 the rest of the way down um, but it is little but and it has like on the side it's like pink kind of right there but that is ten dollars and again these are ten dollars ten dollars flat shipping for um pretty much everything this is going to be a 28 waist and a pretty open hip it's a ten dollar item it is a super super cute skirt very lightweight $10. This one, the elastic on the back is pretty shot, but there is a tiny bit of give still. It's going to be about a 36 inch waist and a pretty open hip. It does have pockets. And this skirt is going to be a 24 inch waist and the hip here is kind of tapered. So it's going to be like, mm, probably like a max 36 hip. Okay. So it's 
blouses. This one is sheer. It is super, super pretty, but you'll obviously have to wear something underneath. It is a 36 bust and has this tie right here that can go around the neck. This one, I believe this one is missing a button, but this is super old. It's going to be like a max 40 bust. Um, honestly, I'm, I'm, and it needs cufflinks as well. I think this was for a request. And so, yeah, but it's super cute. In like the forties or fifties, it's old. This one is pretty open. Um, it's going to be like up to like a 40, 42 best, but honestly, it would probably be worn a little bit, a little bit looser. This one is a modern, I don't know what you would call it, novelty print shirt. It's a 48 chest max, like a 3XL, but it's, I think this was for request as well before, but now it's a $10 item. Just need to make it so that not moving so much stuff, which again, God willing, so this is a 44 best chest. Um, God willing, electric will finish next week and then I can get the painters in and then I can get a maid in there and then I can move everything. This is 38 for the bust. Again, we're still on $10 items. This is 36 for the bust. Super lightweight. This is 46. Let's see. And again, I'm going to try to do these every other week and sometimes I might, this is going to be about a 40, I might be able to do one every week for just a little while. So this is a 42 $10 items. Now I will be trying to answer emails and send out invoices pretty much as they're coming in. This is a 44. But I will not be in the office when the video is posted. So I will just have to, you know, if it gets to be too much where I can't remember if something has sold, then I'll just stop and do it in the morning. This is going to be about a 42. on $10. This is super cute. It's a 36. This is going to be like a max 38, but probably better for like a 36, 37. Now we are into $25 items. Although this one I'm putting into the tens because it is super lightweight. So this one is a 36, 36 inch bust. So that is it for the $10 items for clothing. And so now we are in the $25 items. Flat, this is like a 26, but this can, I mean, this can go up to, I'd say 32, 34, and it's an open hip. So this is $25 plus $10 shipping. And again, the shipping is, is a flat situation. So if you order like, you know, five items, it is still just $10 for shipping. This is a 36 bust. 
And then it is a 26 flat waist up to probably 32 and then a pretty open hip. This is super, super cute. Peplum, teeny tiny little flowers. It will need an under, an undergarment. This is a modern skirt and the waist is 28 with an open hip. It does have pockets. It is in a color that everybody loves. This one is a Cynthia Rowley rally dress. It is up to, a, well, no, I would say a 36, about a 36 bust. It is modern, so it's, um, let's just say large. So I'll give you the, the hip in just a second. It's super, super cute. Really great for the summer. That's a $25 item. And the, the hip is gonna be about a 42 and the waist is about a 40. So cute dress. This adorable little yellow dress. Again, we're on $25 items. It can be up to a 38, could also do a 36. For the waist, uh, we've got about a 30 to a 32, if not a little bit more because it is stretchy. Hip is open. Perfect for summer. If you guys hear stuff, the house behind me is still being built. It is really loud. Um, this skirt is so gorgeous, but it has a tiny itty bitty 24 max waist. $25 item. This is by Hawaii Nye. I might be pronouncing that last part wrong. Pronunciation of designers is not my strong suit. It's a 40 bust. A gorgeous, gorgeous top. It's got the pockets. It does have a small spot on the shoulder. Um, right there. But it is gorgeous and you can barely tell. This is a little Western wear shirt with fringe. It is up to a 44 bust. You might want to size down just a tiny bit. I'm going to cut those that they work a little bit better. We've got an adorable little nautical shirt. This is a 38 bust max. And so again, when I say max, you know, if you're a 36, you probably fit into it. If you're a 38, that's the max. And it might be the tiniest bit tight. This is a 40. And again, these are $25 items. This is a Donna something, I can't remember her last name. It's 34 bust, 28 waist, about 34, 35 hip. Um, it is a gorgeous little 70s, like Gucci inspired dress. Oh wait, hold on, no, nope, never mind. Yeah, Donna Morgan. So it is a modern size eight, $25 item. This is one that was for request, and we had a few people request it, but the sizing just didn't work out. Um, 34 bust, like 28 to 30 waist, and probably like a 34, 35 hip. And it does have, it's $25 because it has little um, flaws that can probably be shaved off like little poles I feel like every time I start looking for them, I can't find them, but it does. It has a couple pulls that, you know, you'll want to probably shave off, but it is a gorgeous color. This one is gorgeous as well. You do need a slip. Um, 36, 32, 34 for the waist and like, I mean, it's a max 40 for the hip. So I would say more like a 38 for the hip. So it is supposed to be worn kind of as a shift dress. Um, this is old. I, again, am terrible with being able to date things. Um, but it is from the storage unit clean out and everything there was before the 70s. This is a 36, 36, 28, 36, 28, 40. 
$25 item. Um, I, I started selling some stuff on, on eBay just to clear more stuff out and also just try to make back money that I spent for the storage unit clean out. This one is 32, 32, 24, and like 40. This is 25. Um, and there was like a pair of dog brooches that were tagged like, you know, Victorian antique in, in that lot. And um, so this one is the skirt is 24. So this is, this is like an extra small and this is one. So this is the skirt here and then it comes up and wraps around. So it's like a halter. Does that make sense? It's so hard. You know, this is so hard. I'm going to end up having to sell this on a mannequin, I think, but it's really cute. Um, so anyways, and, um, and you know, and I put on my description, you know, like vintage antique, these, you know, dog brooches or whatever. And as I was listing them, I'm looking for a signature. This is 32, 32, 26, 32. And this is still a $25 item. So I'm looking for a signature. I can't, I can't see a signature on, on these little cute, um, dog bridges. And I have a woman email me and the waist on this is 24 and the hip is open. 24 hip is open. This is super old. Um, probably like forties, fifties. Um, and all she writes in like all caps with an exclamation point is this is not Victorian. Do your research. Um, does the name on the back say Jenny? And I, I trust other people more than myself. So I'm immediately like, oh man, you know, I definitely messed up. Let me go look. So uh, this is flat. It's 34, but this can go, this is, this can go up to like 45 for the waist because um, it's an open hip. This is a $25 item. And uh, so I go and I get it and I'm looking at one of the brooches and I'm like, there is definitely not a signature on this, but it has a clasp. that's like a push type clasp and it says patent pending on the side. Also that is it for $25 items. Now we're moving into $50 items. Okay. So these items coming up are 50. And and so I, I emailed her back. This is a 24 inch waist and an open hip. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. You just, you have to have that itty bitty little waist. Um, so I emailed her back and I'm like, Hey, um, you know, there, there isn't a signature. Um, they're unsigned and, um, you know, they came, I, I purchased a bulk lot of vintage antique items. It's from like a good seller. You know, that's what she had to tag at. I'm definitely not great. This is a 32 up to like max 32, max 32 bust, 26 inch waist, open hip. This is a Laura Ashley, I think. Yeah, it's a Laura Ashley dress. Um, and I was like, you know, definitely, you know, I, just, I try to take the best pictures of things. Um, and, um, you know, I, if you have any information on it, like, please like, let me know, you know, I'd love to have more information. You know, I did a Google image search. I couldn't find anything. Blah, blah. It was really nice. And, um, and uh, so this is a up to like, it's like up to a 36 bus because it's stretchy up here and about a 26, 27 inch waist. And, um, I mean like 38, about a 38 hip. Um, this is, I forget, I had looked this one up. So it's Bernie. Sorry, Bernie B. New York. Um, I think it's 70s. So it's really, really pretty. It's velvet. And um, and and so she emails me back pretty much immediately. And she was like, it's definitely signed. Look again. And um, and so this is an Alfred Shaheen. And so Karen had. So this is a 42, 40, 44. So 42 bust, 40 waist, 44 hip. It does have some spots. It's hard for me to see them. Oh, they're on the back. Okay. So on the back of the dress. Oh wait, nope. That's just dust. Um, this is how long we've had this. So, uh, but she wrote that there were some spots, but they are probably so minuscule that you don't notice them, but it is a $50 item. Obviously there's a lot of wiggle room in the measurements. 
Um, and so I'm like, oh my gosh, okay. So I, I break out, you know, both brooches and I'm looking at them and I see on the second brooch, which it's the same brooch, the dogs just have different eyes. So on the second brooch, there is a, a name. And um, and so I'm, I'm like, you know, trying really hard to figure out what the name is. And I come to the conclusion that it's Jolie, J-O-L-L-E. So this is a 36, 36, like 32, 36, 32, 44. And this is a Pomer Hawaii dress. It's so beautiful. So it's a $50 item. Um, and I'm like, oh man, yeah, you know, it says Jolie. So I'm looking it up and, um, and this is like between like forties and fifties and, um, and, and so I'm like, all right. And, and so I take, I take Victorian out of the title and I email it back and I'm like, oh my gosh, you're right. Um, but it says Jolie and, um, and uh, blah, blah. And I was like, Hey, thanks so much for your help. You know? So this is 32 max, like max 32. Um, and then 24 and then it's going to be an open hip. So this is like an extra small, a little, a little Marilyn Monroe. We've had this for a long time and, um, have not been able to find anybody for it. And, um, and I, I got kind of snarky with her that I was like, I mean, you know, I take the best pictures that I can, but you know, I'm not an expert and I really kind of rely on, um, this is a 34, 34, 26. Thirty-four, twenty-six, thirty-six. You know, and I rely on you know people who, you know, if they notice something, you know, to let me know. So you know, thanks so much. I'm so glad you so sweetly let me know what's going on. But um, you know, I haven't sold on eBay in a long time, and something similar happened before. Only the last time it happened, I was right. But they were so nasty about that. It was something like, um, I'm sorry, thirty-six. And it was just like a sweet little shift dress. 36, 34, 38 max, but more like 36. So 36, 34. See, this is why I shouldn't talk while I'm while I'm doing this. Yeah, 36, 34, 36. Um, as like a shift dress, and it's got like the sheer, the sheer sleeves. And um, that it was something like I had labeled something like 50s, and they were like, This is not 50s, this is early 60s, and you're misleading people. And I was able to find the item in the designer, and it was done in like 58. And um, and so that was good, but I mean, people are like date Nazis. This is like a 36 max. Um, 36 max, 32, 38. And so when we first started Redbird, we barely had, you know, any subscribers. And so we took a really long time. We would research, you know, every single item that went out and we would write like the dates and everything on them. And, um, but the same thing would happen. So this is like a child's dress. This is a 28, Twenty-eight, twenty-two, and then pretty open, but it's Lance Originals, super, super cute. It is spaghetti straps, and um, and we just had a few people who would either add to what we had written, like email us, and add to it, but in like kind of a nasty way like you should have mentioned this as well this is a 32 33 bust 24 34 hip um and um and so we ended up stopping because it it was kind of just like one it, it took up way way too much time to have to, I mean, we just, the stuff just comes and goes so quickly. This is a 38 bust, 38 bust, 28 waist, so cute, still $50 item. So it just comes and goes so fast that to like research and tag every item that comes in is just not, it's just not gonna happen. Um, 38 bust, flat, this is like 34, and it can go up to a 36 and it's an open hip. Um, 
but yeah, I get, I get real nervous because there are, you know, there are people who are, they're just better at research. That's why I was so thrilled with this, um, storage locker because she had labeled so many things. So this is like a 32, 32, 22 waist, 32, 22, 32. This is teeny tiny. 32, 22, 32. Um, yeah. Anyways, it's made me want to like not sell on eBay anymore. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hey, you. Oh, but somebody has already bid. I think I have like two bids already on these dog brooches. Because I'm like, yeah, they're adorable. 32. I hope it's not her. 32, 22, and then it's open. This is so cute. Um, and also when I I looked up the Jolie name and I still couldn't really find anything similar. But um, I was asking significantly less for the dog brooches than I probably should have been, but I just left it at the starting bid. Because I like for people to get a deal, but um, I hope that she, like she basically helped me know that they were worth more than what I was asking. 32, 26, open, 32, 26, open, so cute. But it's like just speak nicely to people like I don't know why I know people are still you know stressed out with life but still okay 32 22 open 32 22 open so I feel like a lot of the stuff this round is super small definitely a lot of the hundred dollar items are they're very small but um this is gonna be a 32 24 open 32 24 open I believe this was from the 40s um it had no I guess those aren't spots it's sheer it has the zipper in the middle so you will need either a gray or white or black slip underneath it does have like a couple like a little hole right there so there are some you know it's really delicate you know what I'm there's a hole right here too I'm moving this down to the $25 items just because I can see these holes. So this is now a $25 item. Still really beautiful. Um, $25 item now. Okay. And then we have a black shift dress, which is 34, 34, 26, 34, 34, 26, 34. And that is it for $50 items. And so for the hundred dollar items, um, this one used to be long. It was altered to be not long. This is like a 30 inch bust, 26 inch waist up to a 36 hip. It is absolutely adorable. Definitely for somebody petite. Um, I love it so much. This is a red chiffon this is a 32 bust 26 and up to up to max 38 hip lovely hot little mini dress get your valentine's day dress early this one as well used to be long but it is now short because i made it short this is like 34 35 you could possibly squeeze a 36 but i wouldn't try and then 34 36 it is heavy the beading is absolutely bananas incredible and it was just that the bottom of it was super super scraped up this one's teeny tiny as well 32 20 and then open so if you can squeeze yourself into a 20 inch then you can have this beauty i mean i feel like 20 is so i mean honestly 22 maybe 22 maybe a 22 inch wave okay we've got another marilyn monroe 32 22 and open 32 22 open 
gorgeous, gorgeous. This is one of my favorite dresses. I wish it fit me. It is a up to like a 34, but then we've got like a 23 max waist and probably like a 30. The hip, see like the hip is open, but it just needs to lay properly. So it's like a 30, 38, but it could go bigger for hip and smaller would work as well. Um, so if you can see like the detail down there, it's amazing. It's an amazing, amazing dress. Okay. 32, 32, like 22, 23 and a pretty open hip. Again, super, super cute. Obviously the items that I have trouble moving the most are the ones with those teeny tiny waist. This one is a little bit bigger. You will need a slip underneath. This one is going to be a 36 bust. It could probably go up to a 38. The waist is a completely unforgiving 30, 31. And then we have an open hip. It is so pretty. You can see the buttons. I love this one. And then we have, so, so many people requested the little Bridgerton dresses from this last request video. Nobody fits them. Um, it's a 34, the empire waist is a 30 and the hip is like max 34, but you'll probably want to go lower and see that beautiful back. And again, um, you know, I'm wearing tiny heels, but you know, it's, it's for probably five, five and under for it to, to hit where it's supposed to. Um, you know, if you're going to hem it, then I guess it doesn't really matter. This is a 32 max, 28 under like empire waist. It's a pretty open hip, like up to 40. It is absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous velvet, a low back. So pretty. And it's Lace Beauty. This is a 32. The waist is going to be about a 24. And the hip is going to be like a 32 as well. It's beautiful. Again, you will want to be like smaller, shorter. To make it work. Um, this is a gun sax that is more of like a junior's type situation. Um, so this is a 32 max for the bust and then it's going to be like 30. It could be 32 for the hip but if you want it to fall the way it's supposed to I would say like 32, 30, 32. hundred dollar item so this one I love and we had a lot of people request it it is tiny this is by Alex Coleman California um, it's very small so 32 max but honestly like a 30 would probably even be would be better for the best the waist can be cinched with the little belt but it is like 20 I would say 25 max. It can go up to 26, but I wouldn't go to 26. And the hip can go to 30. It can go to 34. I would keep it at 32 though. Um, it is also a petite situation. So amazing. I love this piece. I This will not be going for less than 100 because I would rather just keep it and save it for Jay. I love it so much. This one I love so much, but it was not requested by anybody. Um, it is 36, 36 up to 32 and then open. It does come with the belt. Um, and I believe it is dead stock fabric of, I mean, I don't know. It doesn't have, that's not the design. It just talks about the fabric. 
but it is so pretty. This is already longer than I wanted it to be. It's irritating. I wanted to keep these at 20 minutes. Well, the rest of them are going to be shorter. All right, so this is 36, 36, max 24, open. 36, best, 24 waist, and then open hip. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous dress. up to a 40 bust and then about 36 waist and then up to like 46. I love this dress. It is not my color, but if it was a different color, I would be keeping it. So if this is your color, um, this is absolutely gorgeous. It is like kind of a heavier material. Um, Alf, Alfred Werber of St. Louis. So I haven't looked him up to see what his deal is, but he makes some really pretty stuff. So this little gingham number is going to be 34 max and a 26 max waist and then an open hip. It does come with the belt. So 34, 26 open. Okay, so you guys already saw the accessories. Um, again, it is a first come first serve situation. So just email info at redbirdvintagebox.com. Um, I mean, you've probably already been doing that. So, all right, I'm not going to take up any more of your time. I hope that y'all saw something. And again, I'm gonna try to do these every other Sunday-ish or Saturday. I'm not actually sure when I'm gonna be posting it yet. Um, I just wanted to film it and get it done, but hopefully you found something, but if not, then, you know, check back because I'm going to be cleaning stuff out, um, for a while and I will probably just do like a $5 sale in the next couple of weeks. Okay. Thanks guys.